Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Now in series of MCQs on analog electronics, we'll be looking forward to more questions. So the question asks that depletion region of PN junction is formed by reverse biasing, forward biasing, manufacturing or during heating. So the answer is the PN junction is formed during the manufacturing. The donor and the acceptor atom from the depletion region, it increases during the reverse bias and decreases under the forward bias. Next, a triple five IC is used to produce clock that is C. So for a de desired frequency by setting the value of a certain capacitor, we can produce the clock of triple five IC. Next, doping in a semiconductor increases which quantity? So the answer is it increases the conductance. Doping means adding the impurity in a semiconductor which can be either from the third group or the fifth group to form P type and N type respectively. It increases the conductivity of the semiconductor since it increases either holes or free electrons in the semiconductor. So the answer is B that is conductance is increased with doping. Next, donors to a semiconductor material is pentavalent. So pentavalent atoms are group 5 elements having 5 electrons in the outermost shell. 4 electrons form the covalent bond and the rest free act as free electrons. So they act as a donor to the semiconductor. Next, example of donor atom is antimony. Out of these four, antimony is the option. So group 5 element are donor type atoms. Next, acceptor impurities are of which material out of these four? So the answer will be P type material. We know that acceptors are from group number 3 and they always act as P type material because they have three electrons in their outermost shell. So the deficiency of one electron act as a whole. Next, base 10 system is also called as decimal system. Next, base of a number system is also known as radix. So radix is the basic term which we use for defining the base of a number system. Next, binary logic is mainly based on arithmetic operation and logical operations. So the logical values always handle with logical as well as arithmetic operations. Logical cases are like or, and, not, etc. Next, in a rectifier circuit, the diode converts alternating voltage to direct voltage and alternating voltage to direct current. So the answer is both A and C options are correct. The majority carriers and emitter of a PNP transistor are holes. An op-amp comparator circuit employs no feedback. So op-amp comparator circuit is used to compare the difference between the voltage level of two input that is inverting and non-inverting and also determines which one is greater. So it requires no feedback. In n-type semiconductor element which of the following group of a periodic table is added as dopant? So the answer is group 5 elements like phosphorus, arsenic, antimony are added to germanium or silicon crystals which produce free electrons. And group 5 element has 5 electrons in their outermost shell. 4 of them makes a covalent bond and the remaining act as a charge carriers. Next, Darlington connection is achieved in two transistor by connecting both collector. So Darlington pair of connect or the connection two transistors 
कलेक्टर्स आर कनेक्टेड एंड एमिटर ऑफ द फर्स्ट कनेक्टर इज कनेक्टेड टू द बेस ऑफ सेकेंड दिस प्रोवाइज अड थ्री टर्मिनल डिवाइस दैट इज एक्चुअल ऑपरेशन दैट कैन बी रिगार्ड एज टू कैस्केडेड एमिटर फॉलोअर्स नेक्स्ट अ जेनर डायोड वोल्टेज रेगुलेटर हैज लोड रिक्वायरमेंट ऑफ ट्वेल्व वोल्ट एंड टू एम्पियर्स द जेनर डायोड मिनिमम करंट रिक्वायरमेंट इज पॉइंट टू एम्पियर्स द मिनिमम वोल्टेज वोल्टेज एट द इनपुट इज ट्वेंटी फोर वोल्ट वॉट इज द मैक्सिमम एफिशियंसी ऑफ द सर्किट सो फॉर द एफिशियंसी वी मल्टीप्लाई टू इन टू ट्वेल्व दैट इज द टू एम्पियर करंट इन टू ट्वेल्व वोल्ट वोल्ट डिवाइड बाय टू पॉइंट टू इंटू ट्वेंटी फोर इंटू हंड्रेड परसेंट सो दिस विल गिव अस फोर्टी फाइव पॉइंट फाइव परसेंट दैट इज बी नेक्स्ट द करंट गेन ऑफ एम पी एन पी ट्रांजिस्टर इज रेशो ऑफ कलेक्टर करंट टू द एमिटर करंट टिपिकली फॉर पी एन पी एंड एन पी एन द करंट गेन इज द रेशो ऑफ डी सी कलेक्टर करंट टू द डी सी एमिटर करंट विच इज नियरली यूनिटी so the answer is the ratio of collector current to the emitter current is known as current gain of a pnp transistor next a three phase diode bridge rectifier is fed from a 400 volt rms 50 hertz and three phase ac source if the load is purely resistive then the peak instantaneous output voltage is equal to what so the answer will be 400 root 2 volts next the conduction loss versus the device current current characteristics of power mosfet is best approximated by answer is a that is parabola so i is equal to device current r on is the on state resistance of power mosfet and hence the conduction loss is equal to i square r therefore the conduction loss versus the device current characteristic is approximately a parabola because it is i square r next which of the following cannot actually move so the answer is holes holes can not move next which of the material behave like perfect insulators at low temperature and conductor at high temperature so the answer is d that is silicon germanium and gallium arsenide all the three act as perfect insulators at low temperature and conductor as high because it is a semiconductor which behave like perfect at low and higher temperature it behaves like a good conductor so this was all about this lecture for more videos you can also subscribe to my channel thank you